Hi, I'm Margaret and I'm making an almond cake today with maple syrup flavouring. And as figs are in season, I thought it might be quite nice to top it with a few fresh ones. The cake recipe is quite a traditional one. I've creamed the butter and the sugar together, added the eggs and once the maple syrup is in, I'm going to give it a jolly good mix. Maple syrup, and in fact almonds as well, go so well with figs. The mixture needs to be smooth and creamy before I add anything else. That should do it. Now even though I'm using self-raising flour, I do like to add a little bit of baking powder just to give it an extra lift. This is where I need to be a little bit more gentle. Popping flour into a cake just needs to be folding. This keeps the cake soft, light and airy. We were in Cambridge yesterday, just strolling through the market when we came across these beauties. We get the juiciest figs here at this time of year. And they're such a versatile little fruit as they can be used in sweet and savoury dishes. We like to stuff them with goat's cheese, wrap them in parma ham, and then drizzle them with maple syrup and bake them in the oven. But that's for another day. Let's get back to this delicious little cake. Now I've chosen quite a shallow tart tin for this, and I'm going to spread the cake mixture on the base first to make sure it's nice and smooth on top. The figs can balance on top. Let's make them into some sort of pattern so it looks pretty. And then finally, when they're all on, I'm going to sprinkle over a little bit of demerara sugar and bake it in the oven. Thanks so much for stopping by to watch. Take care. And I'll catch you soon.